to be the first uh, Kurdish German uh, champion. There was never a glory champion from Germany, so I'm going to be the first one this year. My background was it's actually I, I had never in my family or even in my whole city someone who did combat sports. I was uh, fat, you know, so I just wanted to lose weight to get some muscles and uh, yeah, I go to the gym, they said you are too young, you can come at 5 p.m. and try uh, some uh, boxing course, I think it was. And I tried, I s sweat a lot and I like it. So I tried for one year and after it I, s I, I, fight di I fought directly the first time, then the second time and now I am at glory. For the first fight uh, it was uh, much pressure on me, so it was a dream to fight for glory and uh, uh, at such big stage, uh, it was very really incredible. So I, I could not even believe it that I uh, I am now at glory. I won one fight and uh, with KO and in the main event and uh, as, uh, the main event was Jamal bin Sadiq. It was it was like a wow for me. You know, I, it was something that I could not believe. The second fight, uh, I had more pressure. Uh, so. Uh, I was uh, very exciting to win, but uh, it was not my best performance. I was I wanted to to make the KO, you know. So it was uh, too hard to make it because I was the, uh, always thinking about to just move forward and punch and fight, and uh, the, I was only working with my strength, not with my head. And uh, that was the point that I could not show my best performance. I have my fans, I have my brothers, my family, so they always support me. And now, so after the glory, I have also a lot of Kurdish fans from Netherlands and from Belgium, uh, from UK. So my, the circle of the fans and family and friends are, of course, more. Uh, the Kurdish people uh, see me more because of glory. Uh, and uh, I represent the Kurdish nation. It's a good feeling to know who is outside who is supporting me, who is outside there, and uh, all my friends and family always with me. It uh, make me really happy So to fight again at home. And this time, I mean, it will be louder. So after this fight, if you say to me, be ready, one more fight, and you can fight for the title, so I am ready. If you give me tomorrow one contender from top, top five or top three, no problem. I, I fight next fight against him. So after Berian Paposhi, no problem. So I can fight also against uh, the top three. It, it only depends on glory when they want me to fight for the title. I am ready, so I work hard for it and uh, I am ready. I do everything, you know, so I do low kicks, I do knees, I do uppercuts, so it's not something. And uh, if you watch my last three fights, I had uh, three different styles. So I am not someone who is uh, doing always the same. Uh, I, I improve myself from fight to fight. But uh, what is always the same, it's the pressure. You put one goal before your eyes and you can reach it. Because before you, a lot of people reach it, so you can now also reach it. You can now also be a champion because the people who reach it before you was not superhero, you know. Also human like you, so uh, there's no like a magic pill. So you just have to work hard for it, work smart, be uh, be surrounded with good people, be surrounded with uh, uh, good coaches, be surrounded with the best people, and the discipline. You know, I, I am young now. I am 22 years old, so I have to work hard now and uh, maybe enjoy the life later. So it's uh, about this. It's not always about having fun and say, yeah, I am now young. I, I will gonna work hard later. No, it's all about now because now you are in the best age of your life and you have to work hard for your life so you can uh, enjoy it later. At Glory 83 against Berian Paposhi, much respect to him, but uh, I mean, uh, I will end the fight before the third round.